Hey guys, let's talk about the impact about these reprints. They are going to tank the price. Uh, with a price point of $10 a pack, uh, having Jace, Wasteland, and Force of Will kind of has a value. So if you view Jace as a Tamagoyf S card and Force of Will also as a Tamagoyf S card, then you have a few Bob cards and Sneak Attack. Chrome Mox is kind of like a random casual card uh, that really needed to see reprints. The rares look extremely good to me. Uh, Death Right Shaman, you don't get the value to pack back, but hopefully it is really good on commons. But as with any box, it Sneak Attack is also a card that you can get your money back, very much like Kiki Jiki. So Toxic Deluge is also valuable. With the when you buy a box or a case of something. Uh, you definitely need to look at not the mythics, but the rares, the uncommons, and the commons. Uh, that's typically where you get most of the value. So in Modern Masters 2015, you had Adrazi Temple. You had uh, the uncommons were really underwhelming remand. I'm hoping this particular set has better uncommons. The commons were very underwhelming, actually. I can't remember a common, <laughs> maybe Lightning Bolt. Uh, but... I think there's a tremendous amount of value from what I can already see. I know it's a mythic, and Necropotent is kind of a bad mythic to get. But should be an interesting set from here on out. And I will be making videos and actually visiting a few different stores in Ireland. So maybe I'll shoot some film there. Anyway, bye guys.